Okay, so once you've determined what strap length you want based on the gore, the width of the gore of the bra, you decide if you want to carry in high carry or low carry position. Right now, this strap is set up for high carry. The strap is going down, so whenever the bra band is through the strap, the gun sits a little higher up underneath the bra band. And typically when I carry, this is a replica of my Bodyguard 380, this is how I carry. So but if you were carrying this way and maybe the gun wanted to slip up out of the top of the bra or something like that, you might want to switch it to low carry position. And the way that you do that is by peeling this strap down, like we talked about before. You loosen the screw up just a little bit and you rotate that strap around to high carry position. I'm sorry, to low carry position. The strap is high. And when the strap is up higher, it makes the gun ride lower in the bra. So in low carry position, my bra would go through up here instead and the gun would sit like this. Now on this gun, it's hard for the bra band to grip enough of it in, high, in low carry position. Um, whenever this is held in place, it's going to want to slip and I'm gonna have problems with the gun slipping out from underneath my bra band just because there's not a lot up there for this to grab. So I would have a tendency to carry this gun in particular in the high carry position with the strap pointed down. And I'm gonna show you some examples of that now. Okay, so right now, this holster is set up in the low carry position. The strap is rotated upward and the holster is sitting low in relation to the strap. If I decided that this was too low, say it wanted to slip out from underneath the bottom of the bra or something like that and I wanted to raise it up higher, let me show you what that looks like. Okay, so I switched bras here because that wider gore wasn't working very well for high carry, but this is the same holster, same setup, except I've rotated the strap where it's going down instead of up. It moves the gun up higher in the bra. As you can see, it's more tucked this way. You can still access the grip of the gun to draw, but it's held in place very nicely. So this is high carry. Okay, so same holster, same gun, same bra, same everything, except right now this holster's in high carry. And as you can see, this is a bad scenario for this, this setup. Um, you can't get to the butt of the gun at all. So I'm gonna teach you real quick, this is our super secret high level flashbang tip here. Hang on one second, let me show you how it works. Okay, so sometimes it may seem to be the case that high carry is just a little too high and low carry is just a little too low and you want something that allows you to carry kind of in the middle. So for a really custom fit, once again you pick this strap length that works best for your bra gore and you put it on, in this case, backwards. So normally you put the cup of the snap facing up, but right now I've got it turned over where the cup of the snap faces down. I've got this set up so that it wraps around in a circle around the bra band instead of the typical U shape. So you take your gun, you tuck it up under the bra where you want it to sit, and then you put this strap around in the circle. And remember the little tooth, so you're kind of working backwards here. Hook the tooth, roll it shut. And this, I would probably use a little bit shorter strap, but it allows you to position the holster wherever you want it to sit rather than just high carry or just low carry. You can put the gun where it feels most comfortable for you.